What is going on everybody? Gamers Crossing here with your weekly upload, your Thursday upload. For today, I have a brand new game for you guys on the channel called Outer Wilds. Okay, um, let's see what Outer Wilds is all about. Named Game of the Year 2019 by Giant Bomb, Polygon, Eurogamer, and The Guardian. Outer Wilds is a critically acclaimed and award-winning open-world mystery about a solar system trapped in an endless time loop. Okay, interesting, very interesting. So I'm pretty sure this is probably going to be like a puzzle type game. Um, you have to solve like riddles maybe. I don't know. I've never played it, obviously. <laughs> and there's no reviews on it. So uh, that's why I'm going to do this game, guys, because this is going to be truthfully a from scratch review on the game outer wild so without further ado guys let's just go ahead and jump into the video but before we do if you like this video be sure to hit that like button and hit that subscribe button for all of you who are new to the channel and also guys be sure to also hit the little post notification bell that is right beside the subscribe button so you guys are notified whenever i upload a new video which is every thursday and saturday and guys let's kick it let's go into outer wilds let's kick it how freaking 90s of me <laughs> Okay, that was pretty peaceful, guys. Um, again, with the... If you know anything about my channel, I always struggle with the audio volume. So I'm... I don't know if it's too loud or if it's too soft, so I apologize. But let's go ahead and put in here, Gamers Crossing, okay? Create. All right, um, let's go to options really quick and go to uh, audio. Oh, whoa, what the f Whoa. All right, let's just turn it down a hair just in case it's too loud. There we go. That should be perfect. Okay. Uh, input. All right. Let's let's try it at very hot ocean quality. Very hot. Okay. Let's just try it at this, and then um, let's go. And if we need to change, we'll go ahead and change it. So let's go ahead and go into a new expedition, guys, of outer wilds. That was a pretty peaceful intro, wouldn't you agree? Um, uh, yes. Um, hello. Thing. Uh, let's talk to Slate. There's our pilot back from your pre-launch camp out under the stars, I see. Uh, whoa, he has four eyes. I was just reading the text. Okay. So, it's launch day, eh? Seems like only yesterday you joined the space program, and suddenly here you are, leaving on your first solo voyage. What do you say? Ready to go? Uh, wait, wait, wait. What do you say? Ready to get this beauty off the ground? It's all fueled up and ready to go. Okay, so you get to choose. All systems go. Oh, and you use the arrow keys. Okay, if you're using keyboard. Um, at the very beginning, I didn't show it, but it also shows you can use this on a, uh, you know, a controller uh, for the best experience, but I'm just going to use a keyboard. All systems go. I'm ready. If you are, you're sure you're, you fixed the retro rockets. Let's just go with the most obvious one. Let's go with all systems go. Glad you're excited, but remember, if you wreck the ship, I'm not building you a new one. I'm not made of lightweight re-entry grade aluminum alloys, you know? Understood? Anyway, you need to get the launch codes from Hornfells at the observatory before you can lift off. Just bring those here once you've said your goodbyes or whatever. Okay, so... Hey, ah, I want to roast a marshmallow. Uh, oh, 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 what? Uh, it's like... Extend stick. Whoa! Uh... Oh, cool, I roasted a marshmallow. All right, um, let's put this away, my stick away. Oh, look at me. I'm, I'm blue, da boo dee da boo -dee. <laughs> Uh, copyright strike. Okay, so I'm pretty sure we need the launch codes, of course. 
Just like what Slate said. Alright, so let's head this way, because this is the only other way I can... Well... Huh. Oh. Hold and release spacebar. Okay. Eh! There we go. Let's just keep following the lanterns. Oh, hello. Fellow alien. Mika. Hey, it's you! That's right, it's me! Slate said you'd be blasting off in your ship today. I'm really excited to see the launch. Aren't you gonna go into space, aren't you? you better not have changed your mind. Hey, I'm still going. I want to practice with a pro before I leave. No, forget that, I'm ready. You better be, it's been forever since anyone launched into space. I really, really want to see it. Really bad. <laughs> hey, you want to try out my model ship? Slate says it's like the real thing, only less likely to start a fire. Oh. Uh, what? Yeah, let's fly the model. Uh-oh. Why did the sun get blotted out? Okay, there we go. Horizontal thrust, WASD, down, left control. Whoa. Oh, shoot! I can't see it! I can't see it! Oh, my gosh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Yeah, let's go ahead and reset. Oh. Uh, left control is up thrust. And then this control... Whoa, 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 whoa! Oh, shoot! Ah, uh, no! Uh, this is a lot harder. Excuse me? Alright, let's go ahead and reset one more time. <laughs> what? Wait a second. This doesn't make any sense. Okay, that's forward. That's backward. That's left, right. Okay. That's up. And... There's nothing that's on the... Now, wait a second. Whoa! Oh, shoot. But... Alright, so I am really rusty at this, granted. Hey, well, at least I landed it in the water. Okay, maybe I'm not ready for space travel quite yet. Alright. I don't know how to <laughs> get the thrusters on the bottom. But okay, that was fun. At least it didn't blow up, right? I mean, it should have. But alright, here's another guy. Let's talk to him. Uh, talk to... Him. Hey, oh, hatchling. I hear you're leaving us to seek adventures amongst the stars. When you return, let's let's you, me, and ghost go in, go on. Open up a bottle of the good stuff. I'm only seeking adventures amongst one star, actually. Other stars are too far away. The good stuff is less delicious sap wine and more just what are I am. Another metaphor ruined in the name of scientific accuracy. Nevertheless, I do hope you enjoy your travels. Good luck. Thank you. Well, if I fly the ship anything like my model ship, I won't go too far. Um, but hopefully that is not the case. Alright, here's another dude. Talk to Rutile. <laughs> You're actually blasting off in that thing, huh? Uh, they really don't explode as often anymore. All I know is between the space program and Mika's model rocket, things seem to burn to the ground around here more than they used to. <laughs> Thanks for your optimism. You're not wrong, though. All right, what's in here? Hmm. Read. This pilot seat used to be pioneering astronaut Feltz... Felt. What? I'm sorry, I can't pronounce these names. Is all the remains of our inaugural flight into space. Uh, although it's been argued such a distinction requires a breathtaking liberal definition of flight, that day will nevertheless always be remembered as a landmark achievement and... Arthian history. Alright, so I'm just guessing that you could read about all these, you know, different space stuff, like a satellite, and I'm going to assume a jetpack. That looks like the model rocket I can't fly. And their national flag, I guess. So, whoa, was that always blasting one? And across the river we go. Talk to a Marl. Meryl. So it's launch day, huh? Al's going to miss you. Speaking of launch day, I was thinking about it, and the platform these sh those ships launch from is getting old. Isn't it about time you built a new, less flammable one? That big tree in the village would be the perfect choice. I wouldn't mind helping out the space program. Just say the word. Uh, the current launch pad is fine. Thanks. Nice try. We all know you have it out for that tree. The launch pad is flammable. Uh, the current one's fine. Oh, really? Dang. Well, maybe someone needs a new porch or something. A big one. Okay. I don't like how he just has, like, an 
axe and he's looking at me with those four eyes. He's just like, try me. Say it one more time. I'll swing my axe right to your head. All right. Onward. Hello there, space cadet. I hear you're leaving the crater today. If you meet the other travelers up there, remind them to take proper care of their instruments, won't you? Tell me about the traveler's instruments. Where's the observatory? Let's go to this. It's questions like that that make us worry about you going up into space on your own, you know? The observatory is up the path beyond the waterfall. There are a couple of signs marking the way, but really you just keep going and then hook a right when you get to the zero-g cave. Zero-g cave? Oh boy. <laughs> Uh, let's go up the path. I don't know. This alien's from Texas, isn't he? <laughs> uh, I don't know if I have to talk to people. I don't feel like I need to. Can I push him in? Get in there. Eh. Eh. Uh, I guess not. Zero G cave up ahead. It took a right once you get past the zero G cave. This game is actually really beautiful, guys. Very peaceful. Oh. Oh, uh, where is the zero? Oh, is this zero G cave? Let's talk to Ghostan. Okay. Hey, I thought I might see you here before the big launch. Nerves getting the better of you? Right, like you weren't nervous your first flight? I'm a little nervous, yeah. Hey, don't worry about it. Your nerves are between you, me, and the vast endless of st <laughs> endlessness of space. But really, you'll do fine out there. I'd worry more about that ship if I were you. Hopefully that lunatic slate at least fixed the retro rockets. So listen, there's a satellite, which is definitely not a piece of broken mining equipment, set up down in the Zero-G cave, and I need, uh, and in need of repairs. If you're looking for a little last minute zero G practice, head down the lift and into the cave. Or don't, so long as you're confident you can make ship repairs in space. One repaired satellite coming up. Cool, get to it. And try not to concuss yourself right before your first launch. <laughs> okay, thank you. Sometimes it's hard to read that like white text, you know? Like sometimes some words look uh, differently. Sorry guys, I'm trying to make excuses that I, I could read. I'm not stupid. Uh, but this will probably be the last thing I do on this video, guys. I hope you guys are enjoying it. And if you are, guys, be sure to hit the like button and also hit that subscribe button if you guys are enjoying it to become part of the Gamers Crossing official family. And also hit the little post notification bell that's right beside it. Okay, so we're in the zero... Well, let's just turn off the flashlight for a second. Wow. That is awesome. Uh... It's like some creature down here. Oh. Zero G cave, okay. Uh, suit up, I guess. All right, left control. Um. Oh, you know what I was doing? Oh. Oh my gosh, I'm so stupid, guys. With the model, the model, with the model rocket, with the. <laughs> With the model rocket, I was hitting right uh, control. I wasn't reading it. Oh, I'm so stupid. Okay, so it's left shift. Right above control on the keyboard that thrusts you up. Now, how stupid am I? Gosh dang it. Okay. <laughs> At least I know. All right, zero G cave is above. So left shift to go up. WASD to go forward. Okay, cool. Whee! And then I think I need to go down. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. There we go. And this looks to be the place. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, shoot. All right. Let's fly back up here real quick. Whoa, this is kind of... Uh... I need to go down. There we go. Now let's go forward a little bit. This is kind of difficult. Okay. okay. 
so you hold down left mouse button to oh what all right here we go so you have to lock onto it and then you hold down e to repair it cool one out of three repaired okay here we go moving forward slightly okay no nope need to go down here we go all right and there's one more repair somewhere around here this is like trippy trying to figure out where the repair may be. Ow! Oh, I just slammed against the cave. Whoops. My... Where it... Aha! There we go. I need to go up. Nope, nope. Oh, there we go. Well, at least there's a roof above me that I can, uh... Here we go. Oh. There we go. Yes, there we go. Training simulation complete. Holla. Whoa. Whoa. All right, now I got to get out of here. Um. Um. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh. Why do I feel like I'm in like the vast emptiness of space right now? Ah! I need to get out of here. Uh, all right, so I'm back at the satellite. Here we go. Uh, maybe I have to go through the cave here? Is this where I came from? Oh yeah, it is. Here we go. Oh gosh. Oh. 50% of fuel remaining. Uh, I'd imagine it's up here, right? Is it over there? Oh, there it is. There we go. Amazing what happens when you follow directions, right? And there we go. And touchdown. Return suit. There we go, guys. Okay, so that's going to complete video one. Um, of Outer Wild. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, be sure to hit that like button and hit that subscribe button, guys, if you're new around here. And also, guys, be sure to hit the little vip post notification bell that is right beside the subscribe button, letting you guys know whenever I upload a new video, which is every Thursday and Saturday. And this was a pretty fun game, guys. I had a little trouble with the steering there, but, I mean, you kind of get used to it. And uh, remember, just always follow the directions. It, it, does, um, it does wonders when you actually read what it tells you to do and you actually do it um but my you know dumbass didn't see that it was left shift to go up and i was pressing right control <laughs> not even close uh but anyway guys i hope you guys enjoyed it let me know in the comment section down below if you guys want to see more of this and uh until next video guys like always semper fi and carry on peace